everyone, it's Kim with Memories Cast Love. Remember, if you like what you see, please hit the subscribe button below. Once we have 100 subscribers, I will have a Dollar Tree giveaway. And let's get started. This is just a Dollar Tree haul. Videos had just come in the day before, so I got to pick some out. This one is Tom and Jerry's is it lost in space? No, just in space. Loved Tom and Jerry as a kid, so thought I'd pick this up and it says it's 52 minutes. I also found this uh, Warner Brothers video. It's got Bugs Bunny and Tom and Jerry again, Porky Pig, Superman, Foghorn, Leghorn was his name, Popeye, this one has about 12, it seems like 12 uh, shorts, and it's 109 minutes. Then I happened to find this Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 5, Volume 3 video, DVD, let's see, 4 hours and 13 minutes approximately. Not sure what I'm doing with this one. My daughter collects gaming things, so I might just give it to her. A dollar, though. I also found this. It's called Kinsey, and it has Laura Linney and Al I mean Liam Neeson. And then for my husband, I got this standoff with Brent Brandon Fraser, which I haven't seen him in things for a while, so. This is what the back looks like. Can't remember who the other guy is. Um, Martin McCain. So those are the videos I picked up. Then I found this cute follow your dreams little window shadow box thing. It's a mini. I love the colors. I, mine also has still has like some gloves. So I picked up, um, these are the fleece gloves, the women's. These are good to wear under other uh, gloves. Keep your hands warm. Then I still found the Whitman's Valentine's Day candy chocolate bar. So there was this one and this one. And then they also had some Easter ones. So I picked up this one, the Happy Easter. And I'm just using the cardboard uh, containers for crafts, and then my husband can have the chocolate bars since I can't have them because, of course, they have milk, soy, maybe weed, it says, eggs. So I also picked up these cute carrot powder candies. There are eight packs in there, or eight carrots. And each one is eight grams of carbs. I wanted to use it as a reaction candy, but I don't think I will get it again. I mean, all the ingredients, it's just basic ingredients, dried glucose syrup, maltodextrin, citric acid, artificial flavor, but then it had titanium dioxide in it, which is kind of carcin, how do you say it, carcinogen ick. So I will not be getting it again. It is good till... February 19th of 2020, but I will eat these for my reactions, but I, I won't get any more. I also picked up these Easter candies. It is ducks, chicks, and bunnies, and it's there's a five pack here. And again, it is everything I can have. There's no corn in it. It's dextrose, sugar, citric acid, maltodextrin, magnesium stearate, artificial flavor, and then some colorings. And each package is 21 grams of carbs, which I will use for an insulin reaction. I probably won't eat the whole box. I'm guessing they're like sweet tarts or something. So just for me, I also picked up these hard candy. They're the strawberry flavored. And yes, I had them open. I wanted to see what they were like. At first, I wasn't sure that I liked them because they kind of taste 
well they're artificial but then they kind of grow on you and it's something i can have uh, glucose syrup sugar citric acid artificial flavor sunflower oil and some red food coloring and each one is about seven grams of carbs so they're kind of big though so try not to choke on them <laughs> then i also picked up the cotton candy the jelly bean cotton candy which yes there's no cotton candy i used them for reactions i did not care for the taste um very i almost want to say soapy i don't know if that's correct or not but i went ahead and used them but i will not buy them again and the flavoring is like maybe cherry with some orange i don't know so the color of the um, lid and the packaging didn't matter they both tasted the same to me I also picked up a few of the craft bottles um, these ones are marketed for Easter they had them for Valentine's Day they had them for Christmas and the cashier said they'll have them for every um, holiday so I picked up a few I like to use them for um, snow globes to hold flowers for crafts so now I have some of those. I went ahead and picked up a card for my husband for our anniversary. It's not till July, but I love the teals, turquoise colors and everything. So I went ahead and got it whenever I saw it. I wasn't looking for it. I just happened to go down the aisle and I saw it. And so I picked it up and I have to set it back and then hopefully I'll remember where I set it back. <laughs> I also picked up some of the paint splatter napkins. I had the um, plates, but I couldn't find the napkins, so I finally found them. So I picked up a couple packages. There's 20 in here. So this will be, I had thought for my Easter party, but actually I found the cutest deck, uh, pattern for the Easter that matched other things I had. So I'm not sure. I might use this for one of my beach parties since it is kind of... Um, nice and like bright neon-ish colors. Then I also found the balloons that you blow up with a straw. They had the red too, but I just got this one. I wish they would have had it for Valentine's Day. I would have had them up for my party then. So I just got the pink and I'll probably put it up around my anniversary or something like that. I also found this cute pom-pom decoration right here. It'll be used for one of my beach parties. And that this is what it looks like on my back, on the back. And this is just how you it looks once you put it together. Then I also got this, the two hanging decorations. Again, I'll be using it for my beach party. I'll be covering the happy birthdays and then putting my own uh decoration on there to go with the beach ocean theme and then i found the cutest magnets so this one is the um ocean theme it says use on fridges file cabinets metal doors lockers my great niece i watch she just loves the magnets i have on my refrigerator so i'm going to put them on around summertime for the beach parties then I happened to stumble across this Love is All Around Ohio book. It actually had fallen back behind some craft items and that. And I just happened to uh, see something back there so I could, got it. But I did not see any more on the shelf or whatever. And these are really cute. I've seen other people haul them for the different states and everything. But it is cute because it does bring in like some different things that you have in your in your oh in your state and of course now I can't find the page so some of it is about every um every city could have like the zoo or whatever but like this has actually Columbus stated it has um somewhere it had like Akron and oh here there there we got Dayton Canton, the Ohio Stadium. So it just tells a little bit of things that are in your state. So it's really cute. 
Then I got a grow creature. It is a mermaid. They had it in yellow also. This one glows in the dark. And this one, you're going to put it in room temperature water. And then it takes a few days for it to grow. It'll grow 600% its size. And then it shrinks back once you remove it. So I'll probably use it outside in one of my kiddie pools for gaming in that come summertime. Then I found this Disney's Sum Sum, and that this is Olaf from Frozen. Just thought he was cute. Not sure yet what I'm going to do with him, but picked him up. They also had um, the girls there too, but I just liked him. Then I came across this head case. It's a fun game of guess what, and I'm giving that to one of my nephews. I needed a game. I got one for my niece and one for my nephew. So looked like a cute game. Then I saw this United States wall map. This is what it looks like. Then I found these foam mounting squares. So I'm just going to use these for crafts. This it says 64 squares and it's double sided. So just for crafting. I found some poster letters. Who can't use those for um, doing crafts and everything. I didn't see many of these. I went to four different Dollar Trees. So this is all the stuff from those. I also found sticky notes. Or wait, five. Sticky notes. Um, these are three by three. And it's a hundred sheets. So I loved it because it was in the shape of a heart. Different colors. They had pink, orange, Thought green too. Then I got some of the self laminating sheets. There's five sheets in there. And maybe you want to laminate a business card or a photo, something like that. And it has the directions on the back. And then I had bought planner stickers before. And these ones are different. I didn't know I would like them so much. So I picked up the ones I didn't have. And these were hard to find. I think I only saw these at one of the Dollar Trees. I also picked up a 2019 wall calendar. I had picked up one last year from Walmart um, to write like when my bills are due and stuff. And I forget how much I paid, like three bucks or something. So when I came across this, and it has the nice, um, oh, the spiral. So you can flip it easier and everything. So I picked that up. I picked up a couple of binders. These are gray. I'm using them as silver for Christmas cards and stickers to put in. And then I got two of the yellow. Those are my fall because leaves turn yellow. And then I cut a couple just clear white ones. And these ones have where you can put the paper down below. And that's what that looks like. And that's just for my miscellaneous ones. I also found in the office section this tray for, say, paper clips, um, rubber bands, pens, pencils. I probably won't use it for that. I might use it in my junk drawer or something like that, but see how it works and maybe pick up a couple other ones. I also found a stencil wheel. This one is of... Um, it's all beachy theme, which again, my beach parties and everything. Let me see if I can turn this. There's a seashell, palm trees, uh, anchor, I'm trying to make it so you can see, dolphin, and lighthouse. And back to the boat. So, so cute. Okay, then I picked up some of the craft sticks. These are the jumbo ones for stirring um, and that. The smaller ones are hard to stir paints with and that. So when I saw these, I had to pick them up. There's 60 in the package. Then I also came across, these are the six by eight canvases. These are the raised ones. It's not just the, um, oh, the padded ones that just sit flat. These actually are indented in that. So six by eight, I picked up a few of those. 
I also found the foam letter stickers. And I'm not sure if you can let's see if you can see them better on a different color. And of course they're sticking together. Not sure. But they are letters on there. So I just picked up one and that we'll see how they work and maybe I'll it's four sheets and 124 pieces. So it's green, yellow, pink, and orange. Okay. I also picked up the dragonflies in my favorite color, this teal turquoise. They had green, they had pink, but I picked up these. They remind me of my grandmother. So I'll probably just use them for a decoration. I also found some butterflies. This one's got a green and a purple and it's a two pack and the back side is I guess just pins that you'd stick down in things but if you get the larger ones which this one's just a white one it has the clip on the back and I also got a pink one again a clip they're just so pretty so I'll just use them for a craft I also have been looking for the faux fruit. I finally found some of the pears. So I got like three pears. Still looking for the apples. Um, what is the other thing? Kiwi maybe or banana, something like that. So I'm still, I have a jar that I stick them in in the, in the kitchen. So then I also got these cute clear vases. I am using them right now for toothbrush holders. Um, they're easier to clean here, maybe not down here, <laughs> but um, so as long as they don't break, but they are glass, so you have to watch where you put them so someone's not knocking them down and breaking them. But that is my use for them. I also came across this wall decal stickers. I've been looking for it. This is what it looks like up here, and I'm into llamas right now. So there is the back with the llama. And then it says, no llama drama. So, so cute and colorful. Don't know where I'm putting it up yet, but I had to get it. I also came across, this was only at one. I've only seen one at one Dollar Tree. These are 3D magnets. This one has the cassette player. The roller skates, some hearts, and stars. Um, I'm probably not doing it justice with trying to get you to see the 3D look or whatever, but super cute. They had something else, but off the top of my head, I can't remember um, what it was. So then I saw these cute three by, or no, five by seven. I don't know why I said three, five by seven picture frames. It's kind of a gold, uh, maybe brown, brush gold look. Oops, sorry, brush gold look. So I was gonna use them for St. Patty's Day, but I'm not sure now if that's what I will do with them. I also found these display easels, which I had not seen before. They are very big. Um, it doesn't say the size. Uh, it just says place cards, photos, plaques, small paintings, and that's what I'm going to use it for. I'm going to use it to display some of my small paintings on. Just thought it was cute. I also came across this hidden in the very back of one of the f shelves with the frames. It's kind of hidden. I don't know if someone did it purposely or not, but I found it. It says local organic, and it's of strawberries, and my father-in-law had a job um, picking strawberries when he was younger and then he ate so many strawberries out in the field that he said he didn't care if he ever had another strawberry again so I got this just as a remembrance from him how funny um, that story always was I also found this I am very busy this is just a cute I'm always seem to be very busy so I'll hang this up to remind me that I am very busy but I just like the colors and that. I also have bought one with a starfish 
and one with a shell. And I'll try and show those in a picture here. Also, or I shouldn't say I did, but my husband picked up some of the nylon cable ties and that just to use around the house for different things. So they're pretty long. I don't know if it says they're 11 inches and there's 30 of them in here. So just to have on hand for when you need some um, ties, some cable ties. I also picked up a dog collar. This is for... 18 inch to 24 inch neck size it's a pretty blue and I have a husky so I'm really hoping this fits as a backup so I'll have to take it out and see if it does fit on him okay guys um, I also found a non-slip rug underlay so most rugs have this underneath but I went ahead and picked up a couple just in case my thing is they always um, not these, but the rug always curls up on the edges, so I wish I could find some type of backing or tape for that. I also picked up some pillowcases. This one is like a gold color. This one is a grayish, and this one is a beautiful blue. So, I take my own pillows when I travel. So I thought this way I could have um, pillowcases already ready to go. I don't have to dig into what we use at home. So, but isn't that really pretty? I also picked up another soap dish. I came across this really pretty blue one. And that they had yellow, they had cream colored, um, but I just really liked this one. And I use the Simply Clean Dawn dish soap. This is the non-concentrated, so it's not as harsh on my hands with me having to prick my fingers for um, to check my blood sugars. So this helps. It's not as strong, um, and that way my fingers don't bleed um, from using it. So I picked up on these. I'm not sure how cost-effective it is, but for a dollar, and I don't go through it that often. I also picked up some of these Aroma Guru pumps. This is lavender essential oil in here. My daughter loved the um, roll-on ones. Um, we only saw this at one of out of the five Dollar Trees. So I went ahead and got three of the pumps for her. So I really hope more come and get stocked in that because she has anxiety. So this really helps. So. Some people might not like, it's in almond oil, but some people might not like lavender, but they had other kinds too, but that's what helped her. I also couldn't resist picking up that Bolero coconut oil and sea salt body oil to try. Um, it doesn't have a whole lot in it. It's like the mineral oil has some perfume and coconut oil and sea salt. Those are the only ingredients. So, um... I'm going to go ahead. I'm not sure if mineral oil is good for you or not. I'm very non-toxic of what I put on my skin and everything. So we'll check it. It smells really, really good though. I also couldn't believe that Dollar Tree had neckties. So I picked up this pretty purple one. They had blue, they had green. Um, I don't have it out of the box yet to see, you know, the length. It says it's 57 inches by uh, three and three quarters inch. It's made of 100% polyester. So I'll have to get it out and check it out and see if it is good quality. I'll go back and get a few more. We also picked up some of the freeze um, dried fruit. This one is the peach slices. And my mom picked this up and this is by So Natural um to try because we needed a snack in between meals while we were out shopping and everything so she got this they had strawberry and they had this mixed fruit also but this actually it's really sweet it's kind of um the texture's a little weird at first but then you just get used to it so we ended up eating the whole bag and then when we went to the next dollar tree 
I picked up like four or five of these. Then we saw this mixed fruit, which wasn't at the other one. Um, it says banana, strawberry, sugar, and mulberry, where this is just peach. No sugar in this one. Um, so I haven't opened this yet to try it. But the best buy dates go into 2020, um, July and September. So I have to try this and see how it turns out. Okay. Then I got this this cute plate it matches those mugs um i have bowls and i'm just using this as a spoon rest on my stove really cheap but beautiful so that's yeah that's just so i just got one hopefully i don't break it or anything <laughs> and i also picked up um this three pack of little um ramekin cups kind of like i know there's not three in it because i already used I got two packages, so I needed four cups for, I'm used them for, to wash off paint brushes when I had a party. So, just a nice, easy craft thing. And we're getting down there. A few more things. I also picked up this SureFresh reusable twist top containers with lids. It has the cup size on there. I'm not sure if you can see um and that here it is right here maybe um my husband wanted to make iced tea so um from the tea bags i couldn't find a glass container at dollar tree so i got this just to try to see i also found at one of them they had plastic forks marked down which are those little picks so i'm saving these back for fourth of july because they're red white and blue with a few green in there, I'll take the green out. But I use them for like pickles or olives or little things like that. So 25 cents. Can't beat that. Okay. I also picked up one of the mesh strainers. It's a two-pack. It's got small and a large. I will not use the small. Um, I will use the large. I have one of the tubs old tubs that um the oh, hose to close it it sticks up so in order to keep hair from going down i need one of these so i'll use this 50 cents and then this i'll just figure out either craft with my painting something like that i also picked up a couple of these cute bowls they're with um the kitchen things but to me, they're pet bowls, so I use it to put my cat's wet food in. That way, it was really easy to wipe out. So I got a couple of those just for spares. I also picked up, oh, I think I bought three of these ice packs. Mine were those jelly um, packs where it's like in a bag, and one of them busted. So I decided after that it was so slimy and disgusting to pick, uh, clean up. That I decided I'm using these from now on. So I already have some in the freezer because it's reusable and it's even non-toxic and it says BPA free also. So trying to find places to put everything now. I also picked up this organizer basket. It's just a wire basket. Um, they have where they have uh, like your measuring cups and stuff in it. I'm using it to put my billfolds lined up in it, just um, so in my closet. So that's really cute. And then two more things. Um, the Groovy Grape Gorilla. This is a bookmark and it's scented. I'm not sure if it smells any good. I should have had this opened so I could. Oh, here we go. Mm, it smells okay and that kind of chemically or I don't know so you're supposed to scratch it too to help it so I didn't so I read a lot so I'm using that and the last thing is the cute little chattering dentures <laughs> teeth <laughs> and that I bought one and it goes pretty good and then 
I, at a different Dollar Tree, I picked up another one as a, one of my prizes for like the Easter party or whatever, because I know the kids will get a kick out of it. Oops, this one's got a little bit of black on the back of his eye, but this one's mine. Thanks for watching. Please let me know what you liked in the comments section below. Product information is linked below if it's available. And we will see you next time and make some loving memories today.